YouTube, what's going on? It's your boy. I'll be back with another video. If you're new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, leave me a comment, share the video, all of that. So today, I got a special one for you. So as you tell by the background, we are in the Eagles show, which is, so far, this is the biggest show of 2023. I mean, they got over 1,500 tables, and it's definitely going crazy. So a lot of people ask me, where do I get the crazy stuff that's in my collection? I mean, <laughs> basically right here, they have some of the most exclusive stuff, and they got three full hauls of nothing but guns like it's just going crazy in here so this is the first haul and then if you look over here so over here is going to be the second haul so like i told you that's the first haul this is the second haul and if you look all the way down there it's another full haul of basically filled up to the max tables filled with guns so basically what we're going to try to do is we're going to try to go through each one and show y'all everything so i'm going to start from the beginning and go all the way to the end so i mean this is what i do for y'all so y'all better hit that subscribe button hit that like button and let's get it popping i told y'all this thing is definitely going crazy. So many people. And this is only the first two rooms. We got all, one all the way back there, too. Now, this is what everybody's looking for. FDE 10 millimeter FM 510. And all black FM 545. 45 ACP. This is 18 plus round in the extended, and I think 15 in the flush fit. 18 rounds of 45 ACP, which is ridiculous. And this is 22 plus one, 23 rounds of 10 millimeter. Like, this is crazy. Like, this is really crazy. FN 45, FN 510. ETR, we got a stripe off. All right, so you know I have to come over to my man Matt's table. This is his contact and one of the most exclusive tables at the show. Just ridiculous. This is a pistol shotgun. Like this is just, it's crazy. Like it, every time they come with the craziest stuff. And yeah, you see that look at look at how little wear this got for on its spas 12. it's just ridiculous and it has to hook like, come on so this is springfield's new edge i kind of passed over it a little too fast so this is their older model this is their more recent model the trigger and the reset on this the trigger reset on this is ridiculous like definitely get a lot of gun for the price that you pay on that one so got a q honey badger is this new, is this new or used this is new it's not a bad price 25.99 the pistol yeah it's the sugar weasel let's get for this one that one is 31 this. Can't see the price tag on this one. $23.25.99. For the LWRC. That one is honestly like this is a really good shooter. This is underrated right here. Uh, uh, Got the phone. Six hour, three fifty seven sig. It's not a bad price. It's a forty. And this is a forty. Yeah, but this one is just. Inter I'm interested in that one. That's right. Five five. FN five hundred two. Squawk nineteen X. Oh. This is OD Green Glock, go crazy. Walter Q5 match. This is still frame. How much are they asking for this one? 17. That's actually a really good price for that. Still frame? Q5 match. Really nice sights on that one. That's a good price for that one. And then we got the bling stuff. Desert Eagle. Titanium nitrate, then they got the gold AK, obviously. Oh, that's real 24 karat. Real 24 karat gold AK. Oh, 
a lot of collection items. I mean, right next to the Sentry Arms, you got this. And this is why you come to shows. This is exactly why you come to shows. I mean, with the whole entire kit. Like, that's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. With the original box. Crazy. Over here, we got a SIG MCX. This FDA color. What's like a bronze, three in the blackout. Got a CZ Scorpion, the rifle. $8.99, that's not bad for that. FDE, really nice price. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Jeez Louise, look like that came straight from the war. No millimeter. You already know what that is. See the stock. Obviously. I'm telling you, the most exclusive stuff at the Eagle Show. Nothing on the internet, please. Don't mind. I mean, come on. Like I told you, <laughs> you're not going to see this in your everyday store. We got some 12 gauges. At least I think them are 12 gauges. AKs. Okay, so gold is not your thing. They definitely got the chrome. And these are not a bad budget, honestly. I mean, these are not a bad price. Y'all let me know about this one. I know I've been going back and forth with this one for a while. Y'all let me know about it. Same defense, DD M4 B7 Pro. 5.56. All right, sick. This, uh... Okay. Chamber than 6.5 Creedmoor. But y'all let me know about this one. Like, I've been wanting this one for a minute, but I keep going back and forth on that one. CZ Scorpions. Got the PS90. PTR. That camo PTR. I think, is that a PTR or AP5? No, AP5. My bad. First Vector. What's this? B and T? Yep. This is a super underrated brand. Like, I don't know why, like, this gun is, it's a really good gun, but a lot of people don't know about it. Hard chrome finish. This one is chambered in 45 ATP. I got the 10 millimeter. Really good gun. Got the FN 5.7 in black. Oh. Got the FN 502, 22 long rifle. FN for another FN 502. Got an HK. And then you know we got the Glocks. Oh, that's cheap. Oh, 22 long rifle. 43. 43X. Glock 19X. Desert Eagle can't go wrong with that. CZ Shadow 2. And then we got the good old Prodigy. Prodigy, I think this is the four and a quarter. The, the, yep, four and a quarter inch barrel. Mine ran flawlessly. So if anybody's on the fence about getting this, definitely pull the trigger on it because I mean, it's a good, it's a good gun and for a good price too. 
I W I Galil. Chamberlain seven six two by thirty nine. Oh no, five four five. This right here is a Gen One Galil Ace seven six two by thirty nine. Like come on, like you don't find though seven six two by thirty nine. The original cleaning kit. Israeli marking. That's crazy. Kit. That is crazy, and that's the original box. Yep. For this FAL right here. Brand new inbox, never fired. Here are semi-auto pump AKs. So this one is chambered in 762. As you see, you got some pump, and this one is 556223, and it got some pump. But so pump action AK is super rare, it's ridiculous. But that's why I tell you, like, this is why it come to shows. And they got a freaking rocket launcher over here, or a grenade launcher. Like, stuff you find at the shows, going crazy. The Desert Eagle 50 AE POF 9mm. Got an open bolt Mac 10. And we got a Tech 9 over there. Alright, so we got some BNTs. 16. Little micro boy right there. And the 17. And the Tech 9. Tech 9 original. Intertech. Straight out of Miami. You don't really find those. That's in really good condition, actually. You got these calicos. Hey, what's up? Got these. And you got three more calicos. Which is ridiculous. This is why you go to shows. New Springfield Edge. The trigger in it. Advanced trigger. I thank you. Bull pump right there. The Scar 16S. Can't go wrong with the Scar. But this is the bad boy right here. MR556. Oh, the grip on that is crazy. Man, I was going back and forth on this one. I don't know. Y'all let me know. Y'all let me know. If that's the move, then obviously we got the Daniel defenses. Way down. Twenty three oh eight. Hmm. Diamond back, diamond back. Six hour, seven six two by fifty one. Yeah, what's up? Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch the channel? I appreciate it, bro. I appreciate it. Then we got the Springfield St. Victor. The upgraded trigger. And these triggers are crazy nice. Like, these triggers are crazy nice. This one's chambered in 308. Ooh, that's a heavy gun right there. But honestly, where is it? I don't know. The 556 one, I feel like that's the one I might go with. FN Scar. Seven... Scar 17S FN. That's the price of that one. Scar 2308. Think that's non reciprocating? Yes, it is. Charging handles on both sides. Chambered in 308. I don't, I still haven't shot mine. The same thing, just in black. We got this big boy right here. And this back to this one, the Scar 15 pistol 556, five, and it's a non reciprocating charge handle. And you can switch the charge handle from the right side to the left side. 
Same Ben 556. Five, Let me know. Like a lot of people have been saying I should review this one. I don't know. Like, it's a cool looking pistol. It looks better in person, honestly, than it does online, but I do not know. And we got an FN PS90. Obviously, they ran those to the max. Sentry Arms, AP5. I've seen a couple of those. Six Arrow, the Rattler. That one just looks cool because of this. It just, I don't know, it's a cool looking pistol. And we got that little MPX. CZ Brent. Somebody just was asking me if I seen these at shows and I've seen it now. Alright, cool. We got some CZ Scorpions. Another CZ Scorpion, the Micro CZ Scorpion. Chris Vector, Chris Vector. Graton, Sig. St. Victor, chamber in 9mm with that upgraded trigger. I'm telling you, like, this is a sleeper. Like, a lot of people don't know about this, but this is actually a really nice trigger in this gun. Like, really nice. Honestly, I'm, I was thinking about getting a 556 version because I shot that one before, but a 9mm must feel like a dream, too. Full size Chris Vectors. Chris Vector rifles. Then we got the HK. We got the Stava pistols, Micro Draco, Sentry Arms, Stava rifles. It's a whole bunch of rifles. Mothra Shockwave. This one does have the chainsaw on it. Decent. I steam up in that one on mine, but I think you have to buy it like that. So and the Remington with the wood looking furniture, or is that actually? Yeah, I think that's actually wood. Now we're at the bunker. I already know they're gonna have crazy stuff. Obviously, we see the scar there. Scar 17. Scar. Uh, two of them. They got some crazy stuff, always. Definitely one of the top shops. Yep. Canic Rival. Mechanic, Miami day and night. Got an FN high power. I there. get them in like waves. Two I'll get like long. 10 at once. FNX 45. I don't see him again. 509 tactical. 57, 502, 509. Obviously, they got the staccatos there. The P dual. P dual. C2. C2 dual. P dual. What, my guns? No, both of them. Guys are impressive. Atlas, Artemis. <laughs> what, is, what is that thing? Nighthawk. Yeah, this is my guy. I stay in my I'm good on that. <laughs> Alright. Got the HK MR762. Crazy. 308. MR556. I'm telling you, the bunker, like, <laughs> they got the crazy stuff. You're looking for the crazy stuff. There's only a couple of places in the show that got it, but they're definitely one of them, as you've seen already. CMMG, MK47. Dakota yeah, yeah. ARs. <laughs> really unique. Little Hot Wheels edition. That one is nice. I only found one. Is that the still frame? Is that the still frame? What's that? Is that the still frame, can it? Yes. Yeah, the still frame one. Yep. Oh, it's right there. Yeah, the only one I found in the show. We got the 357 Magnum. So when you buy something, it's well, well, actually, the 44 Magnum. 44 Magnum, I'm tripping. Got some yeah. Chiapa Rhinos. Oh. I'm yeah. 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 the, the XL, the new Macro, the uh, SAS, and just a custom high point with the bronze slide on it. Some really nice CCWs. 
And they got rounds for it, even though those are kind of hard to find right now. Okay, we got some shotguns over here. We got the Mossberg Shockwave when it comes to an emergency tube. Chainsaw Mossberg Shotgun. Uh, is that another Shockwave? That is a Shockwave. That one looks like got a slightly longer barrel than this one. But, I mean, it got the bird's head grip. And we got the tactical one, the heat shield on there. I have no idea. Y'all let me know in the comments. The eye right now, I have no idea. We got an IWI, IWI Uzi. Oh, that's a 22. 22, but it looked tough. With some 1911s. Got some Colts over here. Revolvers. Oh, that 45 is nice. Like this is where I find hands down the rare state. And that's why I really go to shows. Because you find crazy stuff, stuff that you really can't find in stores. You definitely gonna find them at shows. Especially this one. And then they're gonna have, you know, the regular production stuff. You got your Glocks over here. That camera one kinda look hard. Over here, we got some cigs. I like how they, you know, they got it in order by brand or stuff. We got some cigs over here. That little, is that a little Legion? I've never seen a 380 Legion before. That one is kind of cool though. My metal meter. Got some Tauruses. Springfield. Yeah, they got everything all organized. So if you're shopping by brand, you can definitely. So if you're looking by brand, you can definitely find what you're looking for. What is that? Little compact 1911. Bronze MMP. More revolvers. Is this? Hmm. I thought that was something else. Will Walter. See, and this is the type of stuff that you find at shows because, I mean, people that some of the people that go to shows they don't have shops and stuff like that, so they strictly just do shows. Got a 502 FM products. Decent. Here's the fun stuff. Oh, they got another Ender Tech 9, it's like a micro Tech 9 800. I don't even know what this is. Look at that, I don't even know what that is. Then they got a Caltech. Haven't seen one of these in a minute. Arsenal Sam 7K, the best AK pistol that you can find. And it got the pick rail in the back for, you know. But yeah, the best AK you could buy, mill receiver. I stand behind that 100%. Sure. Uh, the trigger? Ooh, that FDE. Desert 10. And the scars. 2400 for that scar. Okay.
Then we got our antique firearms. I like their setup. I like how they got stuff set up over here. They've had these ones for a minute. Spy. Now obviously we've got the micro Dracos. Not too bad on that one. Mini Dracos. Some Sentry AKs. DPMS Panther Arms. Now we come to the Daniel Defenses. The DD5. This one, this one is 1849. This one is 1999. This one is 2349. This one is 2249. 1994, right under two. This one is. So that's a 23. Which one, which model is this? Yeah, I don't know which one of that is. Got the rails. This one is 21. Well, they have a lot of them. And there's that big baby. Y'all need to let me know about this one. That's the second time seeing it. So let me know if I should grab this one for the review. DDM4 V7 Pro. A lot of people, I've been talking about this one for a while. A lot of people wanted me to review that one. So let me know about that one. You got some other ones. I deploy. Which one is this? 556? Five, five, little Gen 2. And is this the Zion? No, it's not Zion. Zion is. FN 15 Sick There He has an ID Some AUGs The white one, a lot of people look for this white one I see him a lot, it shows People like the AUGs Okay, so we got these people Hollow Point coding And that's, where's the mobile That's the mobile right there If this thing will focus but basically they do all their own coded and this 300 Spartan edition go crazy. Definitely go crazy. I might look, I don't know, let me know. So I might look to doing something similar to that, you know, and something else. But let me know in the comments. We got the Punisher. Um, maximum effort. That one's kind of, I, I kind of like the color of that red. Ooh, the shockwave with the heat shield on it. Shell holder. That candy green AK. Go crazy. Definitely go crazy. Regular AK. Little holster. Little carry satchel type theme for the shockwave. Obviously, the micro Draco go crazy. Mother AK pistols. Got your Glocks. Louis Vuitton Glock. Another Louis Vuitton Glock. I want kind of. I don't know. Let me know what y'all think about that one. Little baby M and P. Garrison. Glock 19X. Okay, this shotgun shockwave bundle go crazy. So as you see, it got the light on it as the pump. Come with the laser already. So I mean, this is good to go out the box. That one. 850, that's a good deal right there. The total package. ARPs. Some 12 gauges, well I don't know if they're 12 gauges, but shotguns. Now let me know about this one, cause I've been seeing this one, you know, quite some time now. Like this little AK looking shotgun. And I've been back and forth on it. I think it looks super dope and it looks super beefy. I just think it'll be cool to have, you know, a little nice little AK variant to add to the collection. Another shotgun. Another TriStar American Classic. That's 
Okay. And we got some FN and 509 LS Edge, which I don't know why they didn't put you no know, that to the 510 and the 545, but you know that's none of my business. Mechanics. That's so cool. Smith and Wesson with the big box. <laughs> oh, this one's kind of cool. Smith and Wesson's really doing their thing. Yeah, they got a lot going on with that one. Regular still frame. Gersons, Gert, they're coming out with some crazy stuff this year. Honestly, like they, I don't know. I think they're a little underrated. There goes the all white one. Titanium. There it is, the FN Scar pistol. So many people have been telling me I should review this one. Let me know what y'all think. Should I review this one? It looks better in person than I thought it would. I've seen it online, but it comes with a bag. Really good looking pistol in person. I don't know, should I get this one and review it? Is it non-reciprocating? I'm not sure. Batman Blade. I'm Bob, I wanna thank you all for coming out to Eagle Shows Oaks. In February, I want to thank Life with OB for being here with us, man. As always, it's a fantastic job. Make sure you subscribe to his channel. We will see you again for an even bigger show. March 31st through April 2nd, over 2,000 tables of deals for y'all. But again, I want to thank all the vendors and thank all of you for coming out and seeing us.